Hello everyone and welcome to this channel. By the way, I'm Eduardo Golfan and to this video, I'm going to show you on how to use the delete query and also the BBA code in deleting a records. And let us see the difference guys. So no further intro, let us start. This is our sample, the loan details table. And before that, let us create a backup. This is important. Uh, let's put one. Okay. And then click OK. Here we go. So now let us create a query. Query. Close this. Drag this. And you can drop down the loan date, the borrower ID, the loan type, the amount, and also the comaker and the transaction status. Let us check. Here you go. This is the result. Now, uh, what if you're going to delete all of this? record so all we have to do guys is to use this delete query let us select this and then if you want to delete you can just simply click click this run so let us try click run and here you go you're about to delete 17 rows click yes and then if you will check no more records in this table so let us add a data from our backup for another sample. Okay, and let us close our backup. So let us say this one. So what if you you want to delete only specific record? For example, you want to delete this one one hundred uh one hundred ten. This one. If you want to delete this, you can just simply uh, put a criteria like enter the transaction number. This one. So let us see. If we click this run, enter the transaction number, let's type 110 and then click OK. Yes. And if we check this, the number 110 is deleted. Click refresh. Okay. So, if you want also, guys, to put, sorry, this one. If you want to put it in the form, you want to use the form as your criteria to delete a record. So, let us save this first. Uh, sample delete query. Okay. and then let us create a form form design and then drag this let's type transaction number and then also this one is the name of this field is like trans like for example trans id so and then uh, let us insert a command button and then if you don't like to type the BBE code or the macro you can just simply click this miscellaneous and then run query and then let us find those uh, query this one sample delete query next and then instead of run query let's type delete okay next the name of the command button is del delete then finish so Let's go back here and then, uh, by the way, let us save this. The name of this is uh, delete form. Sorry. Okay. And then remember this, guys trans ID sample. So, this one, the criteria, let us replace this. Let's put forms and then exclamation. Then the name of the form is um, delete form. We can double click this delete form. And then the next is exclamation. The name of the this one. The name of the file is trans ID. That's it. Okay. So no more. Never mind about this. Close this. Save. Okay. It's okay. And then. 
Let's go back to loan details. Let us try. So, let us delete the number 107. So, let us delete it. Let's type 107. When we click this, delete. Okay, are you sure you want, you want to run? Okay, yes. One row. And let us see. The number 107 is deleted. So, that's for the delete query. So now, let us try to use the, what we call this one, the BBA code to delete the record. So let us add a button here. This one. So I'll cancel the wizard. I'll put delete using BBA code. Okay. So uh, click this and then uh, click on click code builder. Click OK. That's it. And then now let us type, guys, this is a very simple code. This is a one line code. Let's type current, sorry, current db dot execute. Okay execute space so query this is delete query and then space so let's put uh, asterisk then let's type prom so prom what table so the name of the table is loan details so let's type loan details okay that's it if you want to delete all the records from this if you want to delete using BBA code, so this is it. Okay, let us try. So, never mind uh, about the 107. So, delete. Okay, let us see. All the records be being deleted. Refresh or oh, no more records. So, let us put it back. The records from our backup because we're not yet done and close this so what if guys you want to delete a specific record so like, for example you want to delete only this one 127 using the bbe code to delete it uh, let us continue our coding so this one let us add where so where or what specific field so from what field this one transaction number let's type transaction number okay it's the same uh, spelling and then space equals so this one and then let us put our criteria ampersand me that trans id so trans ID, this is the this one. Okay. And let us try. Close. So if you want to delete the 127, this one. Delete using BBA code. Click this. No message. So deleted. Okay, what if the number 135, 135, delete, okay, so it's really working guys, and by the way guys, um, I suggest to use the uh, BBA code instead of using a query, this one, because um, BBA code is faster than uh, query. And I think, guys, this is enough for this tutorial. And I hope you enjoyed this video. You learn a lot from this. And if you have some question, you can just comment it down below. I'll try my best to answer that one. And also, if you have not yet subscribed and you want to learn more about Microsoft Access, then guys, consider subscribing this channel for more videos. That's all. Thank you. And see you to my next video.